Hello, my name is Karolina Wontroba, and it was my pleasure to chair the judging panel for the Oxford Weidenfeld Translation Prize 2021. This year's judges, Holly Langstaff, Patrick McGuinness, Laura Seymour, and myself, read over 100 submissions of various genres and periods, written in more than 25 languages and published by more than 30 different publishers, big and small. Our short list was as follows. Venus Kurigata, The Last Days of Mandelstam, translated from French by Theresa Lavender Fagan, published by Siegel. Marika Lucas Reineveld, The Discomfort of Evening, translated from Dutch by Michelle Hutchison, published by Faber. Ulrike Almudzandik, I Am a Field Full of Rapeseed, Give Cover to Deer and Shine Like 13 Oil Paintings Laid One on Top of the Other, translated from German by Karen Lieder, published by Siegel. Guadalupe Natel, Bizor, translated from Spanish by Suzanne Gil Levine, published by Seven Stories Press. David Diop, At Night All Blood is Black, translated from French by Anna Moskovakis, published by Pushkin. Esther Kinski, Grove, translated from German by Caroline Schmidt, published by Fitzcarraldo. Andrzej Tichy, Wretchedness, translated from Swedish by Nicola Smalley, published by and other stories, and Graciliano Ramos, Son Bernardo, translated from Portuguese by Padma Viswanathan and published by NYRB. These are eight fantastic books and we loved reading and discussing them, and I'd encourage you to read the judges' citations for them all on the Oxford Comparative Criticism and Translation Research Centre's website, where you will also find videos in which the shortlisted translators discuss or read from their translations. But now it's time to reveal the winner of this year's Oxford Weidenfeld Translation Prize. It is Nicola Smalley for her translation of Andrzej Tichy's Wretchedness, published by And Other Stories. Congratulations to you, Nicola, for a fantastic translation of a fantastic book on behalf of the whole judging panel. We were all blown away by your work. Wretchedness is the first novel by Andrzej Tichy to be translated into English. It is an energetic, restless book about migrants growing up in, in economically deprived housing estates of Malmö, as remembered by the narrator, who is now seemingly worlds away, working as a classical musician. But seemingly is the key word here. These two time planes and realities bleed into each other throughout the novel, all the way to a major twist at the end. Nicola Smalley has invented a unique and thrilling voice to capture this dynamic, polyphonic storytelling mode in English. Her translation does not miss a single beat. And remember, you can read more about Wretchedness and the other seven fantastic shortlisted translations on the OCCT website. Thank you.